Oh no. Well, this one wasn't going too hot anyway. Because yeah, if you go on the SRC board and put the filter on for just switch for console, there's you up there with a the master sword and you me two spots down with the wooden sword. I feel like you would, maybe. I don't... I don't know. I could see him also kind of making excuses like, Oh, it'd be too hard to go back to playing it on the Switch now. I'm too used to console. I could see it going either way. But I think definitely lordy over him that you have the better time in something that might beat him into it. <laughs> I want that heart. Grab the heart link. You can do it. I don't care about the fiber at this point. Bombs for days. A little slow here, but maybe we can make up some time with all these bombs. right now. Could've used that... Could've used that yesterday, but... I think it gnaws at him a little bit. I mean, I don't think there's any, like, actual ill will, like you say. I mean, he's supportive, but I, th I, th I think he doesn't like the fact that he doesn't... He's not, you know, he's not the top dog. this scroll up this time. How about it? Nope. <laughs> That's a block. No, don't know why that one's suddenly a problem. I actually tried even doing the tape strats to get used to using the hair instead of the shield on these scrolls, but when I'm on a CRT, it, like, if I'm not sitting in the exact same position every time, it doesn't line up. <laughs> so, didn't help a whole lot. It's like if I lean back a little bit more, then it's off. Or if I start sitting forward a little farther. I don't have a good chair that I'm sitting in the stream anyway, too, is part of the problem. Move around a lot because this chair is not comfortable. I need to find a I need to find a solid office chair that's not like a thousand dollars. I don't have it I don't have it in the budget to go buy like a Steel Case Leap or a Herman Miller Aeron or something, but... Yeah, 
Yeah, a lot of the gaming chairs, like the racing seat ones, I feel like aren't very comfortable for long periods. Like, you can sit in them for a little while, but I don't think they're good for extended seating. <laughs> Bring the recliner. I remember years ago in college, that was what I had for a computer chair was a recliner. I just had it pulled up to the desk in the dorm. It was like this old, like, 70s recliner I got at a yard sale for like 10 bucks or something. It was fairly comfortable, but it was hideous. <laughs> I think I actually ended up throwing that in the dumpster when I moved out of that dorm. I think it finally broke. thing about it recliners I feel like maybe it would be a little too much leaning back to play in because I, I kind of want to sit up a little bit I feel like if I lean back too much I get too relaxed and I'm not paying attention but maybe that's just me I didn't really want that clock I have no idea what my count is here a lot For the best. Nope, no bombs. But yeah, I've, I've done the recliner thing before. For a computer chair, anyway. But I feel like I just need to suck it up and get a decent, like, actual office chair or something that's actually made. You know, to actually provide decent ergonomics. I just can't go spend a thousand dollars on a chair though. That's a little much. There's one at Ikea that I've heard isn't too bad, but it's like 200 bucks, which is still not cheap, but buying the chair not just for this but to use as an office chair in general yeah yeah three or four hours is about my limit <laughs> um yeah some of these people do like the 12 and 24 hour stream and stuff it's like I don't know how you can function I know part of it's probably because I'm playing on a big 32-inch CRT that I'm sitting, like, four feet from. Well, probably about six feet, but I feel like after about three or four hours, my eyes are almost burning. I usually do try to take breaks every hour and a half, two hours and try to just spend a couple minutes to stretch out and stuff and it seems like that helps a lot as far as like not having back pain or anything like that from it but All right. okay well counts zero now that makes it easy to get some bombs here Yeah, I think about four, four and a half hours is about the longest I went to, though. I don't think I could go much farther than that either. That's. Yeah, I, I don't see how some of these people do, like the 12, 24 hour streams and stuff. Yeah, you're probably not wrong. I think some people, 
you know, are willing to sit around to a degree, but yeah, you're probably right. A lot of people probably do see that, and then it's like, oh, well, I'm gonna go check and see what somebody else is doing. But at the same time, I'm also kind of the mindset, like, if me taking five minutes to go pee and <laughs> stretch my legs a little so I don't end up with a blood clot or something is going to turn you off, then probably weren't really going to hang around anyway. I mean, that's kind of my thought, anyhow. But, but you're probably right. It probably does send some people away. bombs. But I got gotta prioritize the health though. Yeah, I'm I try not to look at the viewer count too much. Um, I mean, I, I'm appreciative of everybody who wants to come in, even if they're just lurking or if they want to hang out and chat. You know, at the end of the day, this is just something, you know, I'm just doing this for fun to try to socialize and talk to people while I'm playing games anyway. I mean, I don't have any interest or even desire to ever try to make any real money off this. But, but I get what you're saying, because, yeah, exactly, you see three or four people leave at once or something, it's like, yeah, okay, well, <laughs> what am I doing? Why, why does everyone suddenly think I'm boring? I had, I don't I had somebody, <laughs> I guess somebody unfollowed me the other day, I think that was the first time I've actually had that happen. It's like, well, okay, see ya. It always makes you wonder what you did, though, because it's like, it takes it takes effort to go unfollow somebody. You can just not watch their stream. Actually going, to, actually going through with unfollowing somebody, it makes you feel like you really did something to piss somebody off. bombs here. Counts four. Uh, there. Four. I like to keep it at four. If we can, well... chance at getting some bombs up here. Yeah, I try not to stress it too much, but like you said, it is kind of easy to look at it sometimes when you see the numbers go way down all of a sudden and it's like, okay, well, what I do? wonder sometimes a blue ring if it wouldn't be faster just to let the stupid like likes get me instead of chasing them around the room but I guess it's probably a bad habit to get into anyway because you wouldn't want to do that with this green tunic no worries man I appreciate you coming by thanks for the good luck hope you have a good night at work and I will see you around Thanks again for stopping by, though. I appreciate it. All 
right. Give me some more bombs here. Oh, okay. That'll work. Sometimes if you ask the game, it just gives you what you ask for. still be green. Just barely. By the skin of my teeth. The problem is I really kind of need rupees. Let's just grab this 10 rupee here. It's got to be a little bit faster than going up and getting a 30. Surely we can find 9 rupees. Oh, that's the scroll there. It's okay. Just keep going. Keep on trucking. Skip potion again. You know, at some point we just gotta go big or go home. We're gonna skip potion. Alright. Well, if they get some bombs off one of these. Thank you. Every once in a while you ask and the game listens. Let's go in here, grab arrows. I like to just go ahead and grab them in the shop. I'm not sure why. The more I think about it, it probably makes more sense to get them later because then I don't have to menu over the bow. I probably should just start getting them when I get the meat instead. That's probably what I should do. Because that probably is a little bit of a time loss, honestly. Hey, thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate it. Alright. See if we can get a scrolly scroll here. Look at that. Almost like I know what I'm doing. Oh, stay away from me, Tektites. Worst enemy in the game. I won't argue that with anyone. They're so annoying. There's other enemies that are annoying. Oh, well, huh. candle's not gonna help there. <laughs> I'm just gonna burn through a wall. Come on, Link, blue candles don't melt steel walls. You know that. It's a conspiracy, man. Six bombs, let's make it happen. That wasn't too bad. I feel like that was a good Olive Garden. 1930 seems good for me here. I would have liked some more bombs, but that's okay. Let me get out of there with full health. Yeah, 
I don't think I'm usually grabbing. I don't think I'm usually grabbing the breadstick there until about um, now. by without getting any more bombs before seven. I need that five. Now we got our rupees for the meat. Things are looking up Millhouse. Grab the key there. used to sword this dude on the bottom to go through, but it's definitely faster just to go through the middle. I usually go through the bottom on this one too, because these guys are kind of a pain, but we got plenty of health. I will gladly take a 44 second gold there. there after I finished five, got a little bit of water on my thumb. <laughs> it's messing up my messing up my scrolls there a little bit. Didn't mean to take a hit there, but that's okay. That's not a big loss. Now see we should have plenty more time to save here. We got a good scroll. We didn't have to go get any more rupees. We're not gonna have to get the Moldorm bombs. We're in a good spot right now. Let's see if we can stay in it. Kind of almost wish I hadn't went and got the potion now, because I feel like now I'm going to end up being like two minutes ahead again and then be. Scared to death to take hits in nine. Right. Stay away from me, dig dogger. Our swag meat. That was weird. Got through and then took the hit after. Guess my timing was a little bit off there. It's okay. So far, so good here. for a lucky bomb. Can't be that lucky. That's okay. Let's get through here. Oof. Bananas to the face. Probably should have just went double bomb there, but feeling frisky and did not pay off really. Alright, come on. No bubble on the bottom, please. Four. Come on, one 
one more. Where is he at? There he is. A little slow. But we didn't have to switch back to the arrows. I don't like having to go Robin Hood strats in there if I don't have to. Jeez. Gonna be another pretty decent time save. Let's go. Minute and a half green. PB's got a chance. too far forward. If he steps forward when you do your little one frame tap on that, you know you went forward one too many pixels. He does that instead of moving, instead of just turning backwards. Right in the buttocks. Okay. No bombs. Well, we got beams back. Had some pretty good breakfast rooms so far. Let's see if we can keep it up. I wasn't getting swallowed by the like like that wasn't bad. Out of bombs though. The game was listening. Hello. Well, oh, good on bombs. as well as Gorillas if you are below them and you're on a half tile instead of a full tile underneath them. Their projectiles can't hit you. No! And you fail. It's okay. We're still good. Didn't lose too much on that. Going into eight with bombs. So we don't have to worry about fighting any of this stuff that's not in our way. Really kind of wishing I had got potion. 
but you know, I'm gonna start dropping it at some point. Oh well. I'm gonna start dropping Blue Ring. And I think, really, if I'm not able to finish with Blue Ring with it, without using a potion, I'm not ready yet. Until that last one. It's still okay though. I'll still take that. Get through the wabbits. seconds to it, that's okay. Alright! Maybe PB Hype. We're a minute ahead. We're okay on bombs. We don't have a potion. Not get our bluey bombs, but that's okay. Six, I'm okay with. Six gives us enough to get through. Go. Well, let's let's walk forward, Link. <laughs> All right. I want to take. I really want to go ahead and take a bubble bop there. That way, I know my count is at zero. Because I need to try to force some bombs, and hopefully not screw it up this time. track count. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I think I'm at seven. Now we took a hit there anyway. It's okay. We know our count is zero now. For sure. Taking hits there. Six. Seven. Eight. There we go. Alright, let's see if we can get a good pattern to try to skip him. Okay. 
I mean, we like to try to skip him, but I'm not going to take a bunch of hits, especially with no potion to try it. This is not... it's too risky. Okay. Go for that one first. Very good. Reverse C. I will take that any day. This really isn't too far from a pace from the other day. I think it was about 34.50, 34.45 grabbing those. So we're a little behind that, but still a very good pace. Not want to take that bop there at all. It's okay. One hit's all we take to get that clip. I'm okay. Mm. Don't push the block, Link. That's not good. Still got a chance, though. We have no bombs to use here, so we have to be careful. Wasn't great, but it'll work. We got through there. We didn't run out of health. This room now. That's fine. I'm more than happy with that. Okay, let's not take a bunch of damage on this system. Here we go. Man, a high 37 might be possible. Need a good fight here, though. Maybe. Thirty-seven fifty. Whew! Let's hold my breath for a little bit there. <laughs> Thanks for the GG, guys. Purple jelly beans, Indy, Shaddy. Appreciate it, everyone. Whew! <laughs> Okay, I guess it's time to drop blue ring now. <laughs> it's the second run in a row without potion, so. Oh, man. Well, I think that's a pretty good one to end on there. I'll, uh, minute 20 PB, I'm pretty happy with that. 